I'm Matcha, and today I'm going to show you how to make an amazing handmade birthday card. So let's get started. So for the base of your card, you can use cardstock paper, which is a little bit thicker, or you can use printer paper, which is more flimsy. So for the cardstock paper, all you have to do is fold it in half, um, just like this where you got the edges lined up and then you press along the crease and you have your card. For the printer paper, if you decide to go that route, you take your paper, you fold it in half, and then you fold it one more time. That way it's a little thicker, it's a smaller card, but it won't be as flimsy. So the next step is to pick a theme for your card. And this theme should be something that the person whose birthday it is really likes. So for our example, the card is going to be for Carl the Caterpillar. And since Carl is a caterpillar, and caterpillars eat leaves, our card is going to be leaf themed. And so here you can see I made a drawing of some leaves in the front of the card. And that's your next step, is that once you pick your theme, you want to make a drawing that has to do with the theme on the front of your card. So I did that here, and then I also added the words happy birthday on the front, which is optional. And I should note that you don't have to be an amazing artist to make a drawing for your cards. And that's the really cool thing about handmade cards, is that the effort is what really matters here. So you don't have to worry about it looking completely perfect. Now we come to the message. There are three things to include. Say something about their birthday, say something about the theme, and say something nice. And these three things can be in any order. So here's an example of what Carl the Caterpillar's birthday message could look like. Dear Carl, I can't believe it's your birthday today. You are such a kind and fun caterpillar. I hope you have a fantastic day. Love, Matcha. So here you can see that I mentioned Carl the Caterpillar's birthday. And I got the theme in by doing a pun, because I love puns, and saying I can't believe instead of I can't believe. And I gave Carl the Caterpillar a bunch of compliments and wished Carl the Caterpillar a fantastic day. And with that, your homemade card is complete. So thank you so much for watching this video and for helping me make a cool card for Carl the Caterpillar, and I hope it's helpful.